Choka imekuwa place iko na crime. Na crime inakuja na, na tuko na kafi. Imetoa effect sana kama si, si watu wa Choka. Na kesi mingi sana zimeripotiwa za wizi. Vunja duka zinavunjwa. Watu wanaumia na kuna kafi. Unashindwa hawa kora wanapitia njia gani? Wanakuja aje Choka. Ni vijana area vijana wenyewe tumegrow nao huku vijana tumelea na tuibia hii mta yetu. Tulemwa kama vijana wa Choka, mafounders wa wa choka tuliamua kufanya operation na kutafuta wezi mta yetu juu watu na complain mtu ame invest kwa biashara yake investor ametoka nje anataka hii mta yetu igrow tuna partneribiwa ina affect sana economy economy na growth ya mta yetu Tume, tunafanya operation tukapata vitu zilikuwa zimeibiwa tumepata gas tume, tumepata tumepata tv tumepata ufas kwa nyumba za watu na ni vijana wenyewe tunajua vijana wenyewe tuna, tuna, tuna kila siku kwa mtaa. Yeah, ni vitu mingi hata unapata wengine wamechimba wamechimba shimo ndani ya nyumba. Wanaficha vitu hapo hivyo ndani. So tunaomba tu security. Hii mtaa yetu ni mtaa yenye iko safe na watu wana time ya watu time ya kafi watu wa, wakienda wakienda kwa nyumba zao vijana wachukua advantage wanaipia watu. Kuna TV hapa na maufa leo officers ya police kutoka choka police post na wananchi wa hapa wakiongozwa na nyumba kumi leaders walipata information kwamba kuko na nyumba mbili ambaye viti ya wisi ilikuwa imewekwa kule ndani kwa hakika walifuatilia hiyo information na this is the recovery waliweza kufaulu kupata eh, of recent tumekuwa na wisi hapa choka ufunjaji wa manyumba ufunjaji wa maduka any house that contains anything valuable vijana wamekuwa kufunja na kuchukua vitu so as we are talking this is a quarter of what was stolen as per the inventory so vitu vingi sana zimeibiwa so we uh, tumeweza kupata hizi leo na it's very unfortunate kwamba vijana ya ambao walikuwa na occupy hiyo nyumba they were not around but ni watu ambao wanachulikana so ni chukumu ya huyu aki collaborate na members of the public nyumba kumi leadership kufuatilia wa vijana ili washikwe na wapeleke koti